we headed south of Changala Shop as we were led to a cave within the Azinda Highlands. Standing in our way were monsters that would attempt to prevent us from reaching the Light Guardian. Changala didn't seem to have much what it takes when it came to fighting. However, the summon pot that he now possesses did seem to have its uses. I had a feeling that this pot would really come in handy in a pinch later on. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
After a tough battle, we finally reached the perimeter where the Guardian was being held. The Guardian had told us more of how darkness was coming, and that many monsters were constantly appearing thanks to selfish greed and desire from other humans in the world. It was up to me now to set things right, once again, by finding and freeing the rest of the Guardians by slaying the beasts that bind them. With a the Light Guardian on our side, we were given his Lightstone, and also the King's image. Changala seemed to know more of it than the rest of us did, as he took the King's image as payment for helping us. With the Guardian now free, our business here was concluded in Alatos, as we bid our farewells to Changala and made our way back to the Silver Noah. <laughs>